In this segment, you'll see what's included in the box and what tools you'll need to complete the assembly. Before you begin assembly, be sure that all the parts and hardware are present. In the box, you should have two wheels, part one, one handle tube, part two, one short handle tube, part three, one flow control assembly, part four, one frame assembly, part five, one hopper assembly, part six, one lower handle tube, part seven, one control rod, part eight, one axle, part nine, one gearbox assembly, part 10, one leg tube, part 11, and one owner's manual. In the hardware package, you'll find six quarter by one and three quarter inch hex bolts, part A, six quarter by one and a half inch hex bolts, part B, one quarter by three quarter inch carriage bolt, part C, nine small washers, part D, one nylon washer, part E, three large washers, part F, 12 quarter inch nylock hex nuts, part G, one nylon wing nut, part H, one hairpin agitator, part I, three three thirty seconds by three quarter inch cotter pins, part J, one eighth inch by one and a half inch cotter pins, part K, one five thirty second by two inch cotter pin, part L, two plastic spacers, part M, two hex flange bearings, part N, three one inch plugs, part O, one flow plate, part P, one adjustable stop, part Q, two handle grips, part R, one control arm grip, part S, two support angles, part T. You'll also need the following tools, a hammer, two 7 inch wrenches, and a pair of pliers.